object of art is to give life a shape, which I thought was a Shakespeare quote, but that is not true. Oh, it's snowing. I've been spending a lot more time in my office lately, not because the pandemic's over, but because we have to live through it. We've had visitors, other scientists come visit us. We have people this week uh, visiting the university. My students have largely returned and it, it's nice to meet with them, to use the chalkboard. I love, I love the chalkboard. I don't do astronomy because I enjoy Zoom meetings and sitting at a keyboard. I like astronomy because I like sitting at the chalkboard with other people. I like thinking ideas up and sketching them out and, and watching a conversation turn into a hypothesis. It's so wonderful. People. People are always the draw to do the job and they're the draw to be here. It was like just over a year ago I made the last video showing off the office and like largely it is the same. The white couches and the, the sticker table. I mean there's some new stickers on it but the sticker table is still there. And I'm finally getting to realize the dream of this office, which is not a place to quietly write and work, but it's a place to have people. The goal is to have an environment that will facilitate conversations, that will generate ideas, that will be inspirational. Both inspirational to other people, like making sure that this is a comfortable space, that this is a place where people can feel safe and share their ideas, making sure that I'm being a good mentor and a good collaborator and a, like a good person. But also it needs to be inspirational to me, you know, like it's good if I have some ideas too. And that is what the art is for. Some of this stuff I've never really hung up before. I've never really had a place to put things like this. Um, and then some of it is just here to try to bring me back down to earth, to try to bring me somewhere interesting. Like my diplomas. I made a video a few years ago about my PhD and my diplomas. They have been in a box for years. I've never had a place for them before, you know, both literally and like emotionally. And maybe that's the big news is that I am emotionally in a place where I feel like I'm going to put these things up, where I feel like I'm going to commit to myself and to my craft. It's like aspiration, I guess. I want this to be the place where I have important conversations and fun moments and big ideas. Every piece of art in here is kind of found from my life. Yeah, there's a telescope that I used to work at and you know, the Death Star. This photo down here is of Scott Lake in Oregon that my grandfather took and I found it in his belongings. The diplomas, they're art. They're there for the visual texture. When I'm thinking about a space and I'm thinking about how I'm spending my time, I love this quote. How we spend our days is of course how we spend our life. And if I'm gonna spend my life and therefore my days in this place, or at least some subset of them, it should be, I think, at least aesthetically pleasing and it should help tell the story. It should help provide the shape. So that's what I'm trying to do right now. I'm trying to sculpt and build and decorate the shape of my life.